Today we're going to be looking at our hundreds chart and paying close attention to patterns in counting by fives and patterns in counting by tens. So I'd like you to get your hundreds chart out. Now we're going to be coloring it, so make sure you have another copy to do other activities with. You're going to need to take out a red and a yellow. Anything close to a red, I couldn't find my real red. This is razzmatazz, and this is actually a real yellow. Um, but we're going to begin with counting by tens, and we're going to take the yellow crayon, and we're going to color each box, skip counting. This is also called skip counting by tens. So color in the box that says 10. And then if you counted 10 more, where do you think you would end up? Let's try it. After 10, we're going to keep counting. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That's right. So when we skip count by tens, we start at 10 and the next number we count is 20. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. If you can't keep up with me, that's okay. Just color a little bit now and then you can go back to it later. 60, 70, 80, 90. And be careful when you're counting these numbers. Be careful, these are not the teen numbers. It's 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and then the last one in this collection is 100. Excellent. Counting by fives is a lot of fun, and uh, you're going to notice that, well, first of all, take a look at what happens with these numbers. What do you notice about the ending? There's a zero at the end of each of these numbers. That's a pattern. And then there's numbers in the tens place that go in order. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So that's a pattern. Now we're going to take a look at counting by fives. And this may not be as familiar to you, so I'm going to count it, you join with me. And we're just going to circle those numbers. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. So there are some very interesting things that we notice here, right? We have a column that ends in fives, and then we have a column that ends in zeros. And the column that ends in zeros is our skip counting by tens.